Capitol Police Chief Jeff Harp and the UCO Emergency Management Director Norman Deeves. Hey, here come the Edmund Retired Firefighters Association. from all of us to you thank you for once again having a great liberty fest holiday on the trolley the edmund mayor dan o'neill here's our city council josh moore with shannon max and olivia nick massey with his wife karen plus his daughter and two grandchildren Daryl Davis, and David Chapman. The horse-drawn trolley is provided by Mr. Carl Benny.
float with Miss Oklahoma from Edmund Addison Price. Addison is the daughter of Chris and Shannon Price, and she is a junior at OSU. She's accompanied by Miss Teen Oklahoma 2019, Claire Grace. Claire is a senior at Stillwater High School, and her mother is Shelly Hendricks, and her father is Bert Hendricks, representing Oklahoma at Miss America's Outstanding Teen at the end of this month. On the float are the Sons of the American Revolution, the Oklahoma City chapter. This unit honors our ancestors who participated in the American Revolution and other wars, who fought to protect the liberties of Americans. This float is pulled by Tammy Bryant and provided by Jim Dittmer and Parade Specialties from Independent, Kansas. One of the greatest things that we have here in this festival, on this parade, is the Liberty Fest Flag Corps. We have four lead flags, 18 U.S. flags, state flags, and the showcase coming down through the intersection now, the 50 foot by 76 foot United States flag. It is carried proudly by Boy Scouts and Cub Scouts. Disabled American Veterans Chapter 39 for Midwest Oklahoma, Midwest City. Disabled American Veterans has over 1.2 million members worldwide. Oklahoma has 29 DAV chapters with over 17,000 members. The DAV provides a vital free resource to all military veterans and their families. And the Midwest City Chapter is commanded by U.S. Navy Petty Officer Veteran Brian Bearfield, who is riding in the DAV flag.
making their way to the intersection are the UCO International students. These international students wish America Happy Independence Day. The flags represent the global community at the University of Central Oklahoma. There are 950 international students at UCO representing 70 different countries. These students would like to thank Edmund for his hospitality. They wish America Happy Independence Day. UCO international students. Morning, the Huskies from Edmund North Marching High School Band. The director is Greg Mendes. High School Band maintains a tradition of excellence in marching and concert band. The band is proud to be a yearly participant in the Edmonds Liberty Fest Parade and wishes everyone a safe and happy fourth. 
and welcome, welcome the twirlers, twirlers Kristen, Kristen Buck, Buck and Haley and Slaughter. Slaughter. Woo. 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 That was the Husky, Husky Band, Band of Edmund North High School. Colonel Oren Lee Peters. The vehicle is courtesy of Bob Moore Mazda. Approaching the reviewing stand are the 45th Infantry Division Museum. The 45th Infantry Division Museum, World War II and Veteran War, Vietnam War Museum. In the parade we have a 1940 Dodge BC-1 command car. 1941 Dodge WC Weapons Carrier, a 1942 Ford PW Jeep, and the 1968 Ford Mutt.
Now, the louder you get, the crazier the clowns will get. Can we give it up for the India Shrine Clowns? And that music is coming from none other than the director staff of the India Shrine, led by yours truly, Dave Nettig. And Norman Crow playing the Calliope. And Mr. Jack Jones, Bill Beecroft, and Tommy Mills.
I'd now like to introduce the Okie Dokies, led by Cletus Henderson. Give it up for the Okie Dokies.
That was Touchmark at Coffee Creek. Hey, don't forget that uh, this afternoon we have the Liberty Fest Park Fest over at Mitch Park. They run it from 4 to 6 p.m. with free watermelon, music, games, and family entertainment. And it's followed up at 9.30 this evening by the Liberty Fest Fireworks. You will not want to miss that. They're shot off over at Hafer Park. Federal Credit, Credit Union. Union. The Tinker Federal Credit, Credit Union, Union has been helping their members achieve their goals and realize their dreams for over 73 years. As Oklahoma's largest credit union, TFCU offers its members the latest technology that gives them access to their accounts at any time that is convenient for them. TFCU returns to its members with higher dividends, lower loan rates, and many no-fee or low-fee services. Check out at TinkerFCU.org. This float is provided by Jim Dittmer and Parade Specialties from Independence, Kansas. TFCU.
serving the Oklahoma City metro area for over 56 years. Allegiance Credit Union knows what commitment means. We love our community and support the red, white, and blue. They say stop by the Edmund Branch in 1925 South Kelly. This float is provided by Jim Dittmer and Parade Specialties from Independence, Kansas. Allegiance Credit Union. Here comes the Bulldog Band from Edmund Memorial High School under the direction of Jeff Janke. The Edmund Memorial High School Band maintains a tradition of excellence and marching concert band. The band is a proud to be a yearly participant in the Edmund Liberty Fest Parade and wishes everyone a safe and happy fourth. That was your Edmund Bulldog Marching Band. And let's give it up for the Oklahoma Golf Car Center. Located at I-35 in Waterloo. This business has been in Edmund for over 11 years. It says we sell new, used, and custom-built golf carts and work on all makes and models. They are family-owned and operated. They are Oklahoma Golf.
Keller Williams of Central Oklahoma. Home ownership has become an icon of freedom that is tangible and attainable. Keller Williams Central Oklahoma has helped thousands of people in the Oklahoma City metro area realize this freedom for over 26 years. In addition to tirelessly finding or selling the homes of your dreams, this year, Keller Williams presented $186,500 in proceeds from their annual Red Day run to nonprofits right here in Edmond. They say join us next year on May 9th, 2020 to be part of the great run. Keller Williams giving back. Hey, it's the 40 and 8. The 40 and 8 train was made for the joy of entertaining individuals as well as being able to let others know about their organization. Their veteran nonprofit organization who helps other veterans, nurses training, child welfare, youth services, and other programs. It's Fast Signs of Edmund. This float represents Fast Signs of Freedom. Fast Signs of Edmund is a proud supporter of Liberty Fest. Here come the Wolves of Santa Fe High School Marching Band. They're under the direction of Sarah Neely. With the lead twirl of Misty Brewer, who is also known as Sierra Santa Fe. They maintain a tradition of excellence in marching the concert band. Welcome to Pelco Products. Pelco is proud to be part of the Liberty Fest Parade for the seventh time. Pelco produces hardware for the traffic and utility industries and sells its products nationally and internationally. Pelco believes in being involved in giving back to the community and does this by supporting numerous organizations, nonprofits, and fundraisers throughout the year. This float is provided by Jim Gitmer and Parade Specialties from Independence, Kansas. That's Pelco Products. Center of Edmund, no you medical center of Edmund. Pictures of freedom. These pictures and this banner is what freedom means to our staff, they say. That's the OU Medical Center of Edmund. Irma and Jim Miller of Hera, Oklahoma, the Oklahoma Riding Spotted American Saddlebacks. Let's welcome the Knights of Columbus. The Knights of Columbus is a Catholic men's fraternal organization based on charity, unity, and fraternity and patriotism. Founded in 1882, the Knights have grown to 15,900 councils worldwide. Charitable contributions exceed $185 million and more than 75 million hours of volunteer time. That's the Knights of Columbus helping build a culture of life. this unit that's uh, been restored to original mechanical condition and the original color by the owner. Say hello to Citizens Bank of Edmond. 
Citizens of Bank of Edmond continues to operate on the same downtown Edmond intersection where it was first founded in April of 1901. The independent local bank is an innovative leader in community banking and provides commercial and consumer financial services, mortgage origination, cash management, and online mobile banking solutions. Citizens is proud to host Heard on Heard every third Saturday of the month from March through October. Good music, good times. Come join us, they say. That's Citizens Bank of Edmond. Here comes Twist and Shout, the all-star cheerleading and tumbling group. Twist and Shout Training Center is a cheerleading and tumbling gym founded in 1996 in Edmond by Orson and Makisha Sykes. Since its inception, Twist and Shout has expanded to locations in Norman and Tulsa. In 23 years, Twist and Shout teams have won over 250 national titles. Twist and shout. Here comes the Liberty Fest sponsor float. With the sponsors of Edmund Amateur Radio Society Ears, Jimmy John's Gourmet Sandwiches, Echelon, Odin Group. This float is provided by Jim Dittmer and Parade Specialties from Independence, Kansas. Here comes Mr. Ken Boyer and his 1929 Model A. Ken Boyer Mail Bonds is everywhere. 1930 Model A. The OPAs. Here we go. And here's Gary Martin in a 1930 Model A Ford. It took four and a half years to restore this. It was only finished last year. Gary, that was work well done. Worth the wait. Uh-oh. Somebody call Ken Boyer. Ken Boyer mail, mail box. 1929 Model A. Yes. Give a welcome to Oklahoma team of Trail Life. Trail Life is a Christian organization for outdoor adventure, character, and leadership program for boys and young men. Operating from troops that are chartered, they are in all 50 states. The K-12 program centers on outdoor experience that builds a young man's skill and allows him to grow on a personal level as a role model and leader for his peers. Oklahoma team of trail life. Happy Independence Day. Trail Life USA building adventure, character, and leadership right here in Oklahoma. You have a young man in their age, I bet you they would like to see him. Oklahoma Cushman Club. These classic scooters are built from 1935 to 1965. If you were 14, this was the only thing you could ride. Guys paid for them by throwing papers and mowing yards. We have 180 members of old men reliving their teenage years. Old men, old scooters, the Oklahoma Cushman Club. Hey, it's America's Incredible Pizza Company. America's Incredible Pizza Company in Oklahoma City is located at Northwest Expressway in MacArthur and has more indoor attractions than any other family entertainment center. We've got over 150 items on our all-you-can-eat buffet, and it's fun for the entire family. 
check them out at www.incrediblepizza.com. Say hello to the American Heritage Girls. The American Heritage Girls were founded by a group of parents wanting a faith-based, scout-type character development program for their daughters in 1995. The AHG is dedicated to the mission of building women of integrity through service to God, family, community, and country. AHGs across the nation and globe to participate in programs, service projects, leadership, and outdoor experiences, all with an emphasis on Christian values and family involvement. That's American Heritage Girls. Hey, look, it's the Sooner Model A Club. The Sooner Model A Club is dedicated to the restoration and preservation of these antique cars. Each car has been restored by its owner to better than new condition, and most owners have added modern safety features such as seat belts and turn signals. The club welcomes all Model A owners and enthusiasts to join our club through our website and on our Facebook group. And oh man, take a look now because this is the Central Oklahoma Corvette Club. They are, promote social, charitable, and entertaining events that encourage members to share mutual enjoyment of the Corvette. These members enjoy competing in shows, supporting charities, cruising new locations, and all types of food, they say. The Central Oklahoma Corvette Club has 300 members and holds the largest outdoor Corvette show in Oklahoma each June. The event is held in Hayford Park and attracts more than 200 competitors. The charities they support are Pepper's Ranch, Ryan's Cases for Smiles, the Edmund Hope Center, Center for a Family, Little Light Christian School. That is the Central Oklahoma Corvette Club. Run, run. That is the great American sports car. Yellow Stingray, every young man's dream. Welcome to the village at Bradford Village. Bradford Village has been a fixture in the Edmond community since 1957. Independent living, cottages, assisted living, and a health care center on 33 acres in the heart of beautiful Edmond. Check them out. The Edmond Bradford Village. Hey, when you need them, let's call them. This is Redbeard Plumbing. Redbeard Plumbing is a family-owned plumbing company established by Luke and Lindsay Kelly in 2013. They serve Edmond and Oklahoma City. They offer residential and commercial service for water, sewer, natural gas, drain cleaning, video inspections, tank and tank with water heaters, and they are leak experts. Oh, my goodness. Stay in the tub. They will... Give you a, they wish you a safe and happy Independence Day. Here comes the Vital Signs of Oklahoma. You know, since 1996, Vital Signs of Oklahoma has been a family-owned and operated commercial sign business located right here in Edmond, Oklahoma. Thank you for all the great memories of Liberty Fest and for all those to come. We thank you for being with us. Vital Signs of Oklahoma. Here we go, it's Jazzercise, the number one dance fitness program in the world, celebrating 50 years of fun and fitness for everyone. Jazzercise Edmund has probably served the Edmund community, proudly served the Edmund community for over 30 years. Love your workout with us at Bryant for over 60 classes to choose from. It says get involved with cutting edge workouts to fresh music in your favorite artists. Check them out at jazzercise.com. And here's a staple on Route 66. It's the Round Barn. The Round Barn in Central Oklahoma, Route 66, is presenting the Round Oklahoma County and Metro Oklahoma City to the world for almost 30 years. The snapshots of freedom are countless and will continue for as long as there is an Oklahoma and a highway to travel her. 
say hello to Dental Depot. Dental Depot has been seeing families in Oklahoma since 1978. We're committed to compassionate, affordable care for patients of all ages. It is our honor to join you this Independence Day. Have a safe and happy holiday for all of us at Dental Depot. Approaching the stand is NAMI of Edmond, the North Oklahoma City. The National Alliance of Mental Illness provides support and free education to families and caretakers of the severely mentally ill. This year's float spotlights the brain, the central system of the human, the body. NAMI helps families understand that when this biological system fails to work correctly, they and their loved ones may experience cessation of some freedoms and rights due to the stigma surrounding these illnesses. Check out NAMI and the important service and education that they provide. Ignite the hope, they say. Here comes the Joker and Harley Quinn. Riding in the float with Jedi Oklahoma City. Jedi OKC is Oklahoma's largest Star Wars fan club since 2001. They've been supporting the community with volunteer work and fundraising. As they check them out on Facebook or JediOklahomaCity.com, OKC.com. Where are you going to be on 12-20-2019? Seen the final chapter, Star Wars, The Rise of Skywalker. We'll see you in December. Darth Vader under the umbrella, well. That is Jedi OKC. Say hello to Tim Farmer Designs. Tim Farmer Designs since 1990, designing custom homes and commercial buildings throughout the metro. Tim and his lovely consultant Libby are here today to wish you a happy Independence Day. Thank you veterans for making today possible. Thank you Tim and Libby from Tim Farmer Designs. Here come, Here come Wild, Wild West, West Trailers. Wild West Trailers is a family owned and operated business located here in Edmond. It is being led today by Dustin Wilder, a Marine veteran who served in Iraq and Afghanistan. Thank you, Dustin. They offer a hassle-free buying experience and a military and first responder discount. Look them up at wildwesttrailers.com. Followed by AT&T Mechanical Heating and Air Services. A&T Mechanical is a small family owned and operated business located here in Edmond. They are dedicated to offering the best professional and personalized service for every customer at an affordable rate. Customer satisfaction is our number one goal. They say call us today for a free estimate at 810-8891. A&T Mechanical. Hey, here comes SunTech. Heat and Air and Plumbing Electric. They've been around since 1986. They've been ensuring Edmond residents' heating and air conditioning units have been running smoothly year-round. They have the experience to, experience to set you on the path to a more cost-effective, environmentally friendly way of heating and cooling your home. For an honest assessment, give them a call. SunTech. Miss Amazing Oklahoma. Oklahoma Miss Amazing is an organization that provides opportunities for girls and women with disabilities to build confidence and self-esteem in a supportive environment. Their key program is an annual two-day event promoting self-advocacy and providing an opportunity for girls to display their passions. www.ok.missamazing.org.
the honor, honor crew. crew. Whoa, well, let's. The honor crew, they're here to protect and serve. The honor crew is an organization dedicated to helping families and spouses of deployed military personnel. Follow them on Facebook and Instagram. Here comes a 1927 Farmall Tractor. Followed by the Model A 1947 John Deere. Riding that John Deere green. It was built in 1947. It's a road crop tractor by John Deere. The total of 300,000, 300,000 were built. They were powered by a two cycle multi fuel engine. Look out, here comes the speed driver. Hey, let's give it up for the Heartland Camaro Girls. Heartland Camaro Girls are all female-owned and co-owned. We are a non-profit group that helps communities out in style. Toys for Tots, Trunk and Treats, and other charities are helped in Oklahoma. That's the Oklahoma Camaro Girls. Oh, yeah. There's a whole lot of girl power running down the street right now. Followed by the Oklahoma Camaro Girls is the Heartland Camaro of Oklahoma City. Heartland Camaro is a non for profit group that helps communities in style. We work with Toys for Tots and many other charities. That's Heartland Camaro's OKC.